Okay, make sure that you are putting your last name and your first name and then your class that you have math class. Um, we are still reviewing radius, diameter, um, circumference, area, and then volume of spheres. No, not spheres, volume of cylinders. Um, in this case, I could look at the picture. The diameter is all the way across, so my diameter is 7 centimeters. The radius is half of that. So just in case you can't do half of 7, use your calculator. 7 divided by 2 is 3.5. So my radius is 3.5 centimeters. We're going to use this formula to calculate the circumference. So I'm going to take the diameter of 7, substitute it in. 7 times pi equals the circumference. I will do 7 times pi equals 21.991. That 1 it's going to stay 21.99. It's really close to 22, but it's not. So 21.99, and this was centimeters, so cm. Okay, now we need to do the area. Since we have the radius is 3.5, that comes from here. We're going to put that down here, do 3.5 times 3.5 times pi equals my area. So I'll use your calculator that you guys like. 3.5 times 3.5. Nope, nope, see, I got to clear it because look what happened. I didn't put a point. Times pi equals 38.48. I'm looking next door. That 4 says to stay the same, so it's 38 and 48 hundredths. Seems really strange, but it is what it is. And area, remember, takes up the whole space, so it's two-dimensional. Um, so I have to do cm caret 2, it's centimeters squared. Hit next. We're going to find the volume of the cylinder. It tells me what the diameter is. So this is my diameter, but it does not want the diameter. I have to change it to the radius, which is only half of it. So radius is 4. If you're going to make a mistake on these, that is where. So make sure you think when you take your quiz. So I'm going to put this 4 here. So 4 times 4 times pi times the 5, which is the height. See, height. That's a terrible 5. I apologize. Use your calculator. Clear, clear, clear. 4 times 4 times pi times 5. I'm going to round, so I'm looking next door. That 7 says that 2 should turn into a 3. 251 and 32 hundredths. 251. 33 hundredths. And because I did meters times meters times meters times meters, that means I did meters to the third power. Um, you guys can submit. Well, I'm going to submit. Make sure that I'm right. You keep listening. Missed two. So let's see what I did. Oh, I'll fix that for you guys. This says I should have rounded. I think I disagree. So let's see. It was radius squared, so 3.5 times 3.5 times pi. No. Wait a minute. Circumference. It should be. 7 times pi. Yeah, no, the answer is not, no, it's 21.99. So what we typed in was correct. I'll fix this for you guys.